I am Jamie with JD Precision Plumbing here with October's Community Giveaway winner, the Crisis Assistance Center, and here I have Miss Jennifer. And Miss Jennifer, do you want to tell us a little? So, for someone who doesn't know about Crisis Assistance Center in Montgomery County, I mean, obviously you're handling crisis, but what, how are you assisting people? So we work with individuals and families during a time of crisis. So whether that is um, homelessness, some sort of disaster, or um, really lack of ability right now, like loss of job ability to pay bills. We'll mm -hmm. help with rent, mortgage, uh, utility assistance, wow. clothing, food. Um, I think we're most proud of our self-sufficiency program, though, our hand-up program. So we really try and help those that continue to come back in crisis, um, figure out how we can lift them up out of that position wow. and get them to a point of self-sufficiency. Awesome. So we do that as well. And then we have a permanent supportive housing program where we house families that are um, chronically homeless and disabled. And so we love the work that we do. We help our neighbors and that's really why we're all here. So. Super cool. So how do you, um, how do you guys get your funding? We have a lot of funding partners. So we're a United Way agency. We also um, get a lot of funding from different organizations. Uh, Kathy does a great job with our three fundraisers every year. So we do our Duck Derby. We also do our um, Legacy Luncheon and then our top, top Gun Top Golf Tournament every February. So it's our version of a golf tournament. It's super fun and we really cool. enjoy it. So I heard something about um, Montgomery County and volunteer hours. Mm -hmm. with the courthouse. Can you mm -hmm. tell me a little bit more about that because that was cool. So we're very blessed to have a partnership with um, actually the probation system and so they will send um, individuals that need uh, community service hours there in the process of working for a second chance and so we let them come and do their community service hours here. They also can donate um, food packages for community service hours which go straight into our food pantry, um, baby kits for our food pantry, and then also back to school supplies that during that cool. time as well. So for people watching that want to um, donate to you, how would they go about donating? To you, are y'all looking for physical items or monetary or food or what everything? Do need? So we're always in need of everything. It, as you can see, we're in our resale shop, so we always need items. Everything in here is donated. That goes out into the community in two ways: either people purchase it, which is a, a way that we make money. We have an income source through that, and everything goes right back into our programs. Or we use vouchers, and that's when individuals or families can't pay for those items, but we will voucher them out so everything comes from here to them at no cost. Wow. And that's um, a, one more way we can help somebody in need during that time. Super cool. All right. But and we always need food, and we you? always need volunteers, and we always need money. So, so. volunteers. So yes. people, if they wanted to come and help you guys out, they mm -hmm. just... Is the information on the website? On our website, or? which is www.cac-mctx.org, and there's a link for volunteers there. Perfect. Well, cool. Well, thank you so much for sharing. About thank the you. We appreciate all that you guys are of doing. Course. This is amazing. It's fun. So. fun to learn about.